Hello YouTube, Jibo Unit here, and I have a special guest today, my son Kellen. Say hi. Hi. Okay. Um, uh, I'm going to do, or Kellen's going to show a pistol that I've already done a review on, and if you've watched my reviews, you know exactly what this is, but I'm going to let my son talk about it. So, Kellen, what is, what is this pistol? A Ruger Mark III Standard. Okay. Very good. And if you have not seen the videos, here it is, Mark III Standard. So I'm going to let Kellen talk a little bit about it. I uh, taught him a, f a couple of things. And what's the number one rule of gun safety? Assume there's bullets in the gun. Oh, why do you want to assume that there's bullets in the gun? So it won't shoot anyone or hurt anyone. That's right. Okay, so what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to safety check the gun to make sure it's empty, right? Okay, so pull that back. No bolts. Okay. All right. Okay, now I'm going to hand this over to Kellen, and he's going to tell a little bit what he's learned about this gun. Okay, go ahead. Show the camera. Hold it up so you can see. So as you can see, this is the the bolt stop. This is the bolt stop. And so people out there might be putting their uh, their finger on the trigger. Get closer. The finger on the trigger, but that's not a good idea. How come it's not? How come it's not a good idea to put your finger on the trigger? Because if when you go like this and then you accidentally press it. At the shooting range, it might like bounce and then bounce back at you, or it might hit the wall and hurt someone. So where do you put your finger at? You put your finger at here next to the bolt stop. Well, next to the bolt. Okay. Chamber. Okay. So and this is your shooting position. Don't put your finger on the trigger unless you're aiming and ready to shoot. Very good. Okay, why don't you show the rest of the pistol? Okay, show this, the parts. This is the um, barrel. Okay. Front front sight. Very good. Rear sight. Show the show the camera so they can see. And this is the bolt. Here, I'll bolt pull ears. that. Okay, he's a little too little to pull that bolt back. Okay. And this is the chamber. Oh, what what's uh how, what's important about the chamber? Check if the bolt is in. Okay. There's no bullets. Okay. What about the other buttons? This is the bolt stop. Okay. Which I already told you. Okay. And. Um, what about the other buttons? This this is the. Uh, this is the. Show the camera. This is. This is the. Um. The magazine, but the. Release like the magazine releaser. Check if there's bullets in it. There's no bullets. Okay, what's that other button? Safety button. Okay, and then what about these things here? This is the trigger. Okay. This is the um, trigger guard. Okay. And, um, and show that show that shooting position from right there. You want to keep your arms straight, right? Two hands. Okay, very good. And then when you're done with it, you're going to point it down, down range, right? And put it on the table. Put it on the table. Okay, very good. Okay, so that's um, that's Kellen talking about the, uh, the the pistol. And what I wanted to do, I wanted to introduce him to uh, my firearms so that he's aware of them and uh, you know it, it's I want him to to know about this um, and learn a little bit about firearms so that you know <clears throat> he's not growing up scared of them or, or anything like that because we all know that the dangerous part about guns is the person behind the trigger so uh, a gun is gonna sit here just like this it's gonna sit there and it's not gonna shoot anybody it's the person who gets it that is a danger to everybody. So, 
It can sit here for a hundred years and it's not going to shoot or harm anybody. It's kind of like a car. If you like, if you like, this is a bad idea. If you like, take your hand on it and go like, boom, and there's a bullet in there, they, it, it might shoot back and try to like, might shoot back if it's like a strong gun or something. Then it might like shoot back and like try like to hit you, but th this will like fire at the person in front of you. Okay, what are you going to do if you find a gun like this laying around? You have to put your hand, your finger right here, mm -hmm. and just pull it like that. When you're aiming downfield, you have to put, when you aim, you put your finger on the trigger, that's when, and boom. But what if you find a gun laying around? Um, if my dad was, if my dad was around, then I would just say, I found a gun on the floor, what, what do I do with it? He would probably say like, he would say check in the chamber. He might he might do it or my, I might do it. I'm gonna do that. So, yeah. so okay. Well, good. Very good. All right. So he's got some basic knowledge of, of some gun safety, and of course I'll keep enforcing that with him. Um, but otherwise, uh, that's really about it. So this is Kellen's first video, and he did a very good job introducing reintroducing the Ruger Mark III standard. So uh, that's really about it. And thank you. And we'll see you at the next video. Say bye, Kellen. Bye. All right. Say bye. Bye. <laughs>